What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about Skims bras. I feel like I might have mentioned this before, but I did not want to be a fan of Skims or really anything related to the Kardashians. Yes, I love the show, but I really didn't want to like their products. But I do. I love Good American. I love Kylie Cosmetics and I do love Skims. I haven't tried Kim's skincare line. I probably never will, but her clothing, love everything from Skims. So I've tried a lot of bras out there and when you're bigger on top, it can be a little challenging to find the fun tops, which I wanted for years. But now that I am a young professional, I mean, maybe I'm just a regular adult now. Maybe I'm not even a young professional. Maybe I'm just a professional. I stick to neutral colored bras. So a lot of my bras end up being beige and black. And so I just got a Skims package delivered today. You can see I already opened it up because I got the new push-up bra and I don't think I need a push-up bra. I feel like when you're bigger on top, you really don't need it. But the videos I saw on Instagram really kind of sold me on it. And one thing I was always hoping to see but never saw was the inside. So I'm here to show you the inside of that bra. I know the whole point of it is to give you a better shape that other regular push-ups don't give you. And I haven't used a push-up bra in years. Because again, I don't feel like I need it. But here is the inside. I have had some push-up bras in the past where you could clearly see um, that actual push-up part of the bra. But this looks like a normal bra. But you can feel the extra cushion. So it's like pretty non-existent here. But the deeper you go down into the bra itself, there is a lot more padding. But it doesn't feel like it would feel overpowering compared to a bra like this where there is absolutely no extra padding. Like this kind of just feels like a pillow. And this one does not. So I thought I would do a little try on because I am not one of the people on Skims' um, PR list. But real quickly, I do want to talk about the bra I have on right now because I have finally found the perfect strapless bra. Of course, it's from Skims. I'm wearing this tube top from Amazon. And this bra itself, which when I switch out bras, I will show you, it is the perfect strapless bra. It actually stays up. And I don't know if it's because of the brand and Skims just does a good job with their bras or if it's because I went down a band size. So I'm a 34 double D. I went down to a, I think it was a 32 double D and it stays up so well. Like I never have to worry about it fully coming down. Like it might move down a tiny bit, but it really isn't a big deal because I can just do a little tug and it'll be fine. Whereas with other strapless bras that I've tried, I really have to like readjust everything. And I'm super happy I found this because I like that you can have actual shape with this. Whereas with the bandeau, it's um, pretty shapeless, but it's nice for, um, depending on your outfit, it's nice on certain things. The other bra I really like from Skims that I quickly want to mention is this. I think it's called the Triangle Bra. Sizing on this one was a little bit weird and it looks like I can't even read the sizing on this anymore. I'll have to look back on my order and I'll write it down in the description box. Oh, I have another one too that I forgot to grab. So I have one, two, three, four. I have, wait, one, two, three, four. Five. I have six different bras from Skims now, so. So you could call me a true fan. But this is super comfortable. I absolutely love how this feels. There is no fan. It's just a very nice, relaxing bra that still gives you support. And so to fully experience the full try on, I also got a t-shirt because I've been wanting it. Well, actually I really needed to get free shipping. So I was like, well, I've always been wanting a shirt. So now I got a skin shirt. So I'm going to try this on first with this bra that is like, to pretty much my everyday bra um, and then I will switch out and I'll show you what it looks like and then I'll switch to the push-up bra so all of my bras except for the strapless is a 34 double D I feel like this one was either like a small or large and I don't I don't remember and then I think this one maybe I can still find the sizing on this this bandeau bra is a large I also kind of want to show you my outfit because I really love it it's a nice casual running errands type of outfit. I have biker shorts from Amazon with pockets. And then my top from Amazon, which this totally sucks. I can't show you the full outfit. Um, and then this from Target, I think. Yes, this is from Target. 
All right, so now I'm going to switch out my bras and we'll do a try on. I have the bra on now. I got some deodorant on it. I feel like I need to move this back so that you can fully see. Okay, so I'm wearing the black. I think it's called the Fit Everybody Bra. Here's what it looks like. This is a size small t-shirt. Let me try and give you this angle so you can see. I mean, I feel like it's a pretty good shape. And this is my everyday bra, so I really have no issue with this. But I was curious to see how the new push-up bra from Skims would look on me. So there's that. Let me just pull up these shorts. This is how um, this is the length of the shirt, but there we go. So no issues with this bra at all. Oh, and then here is the strapless bra. So yes, this is a 32 double D. It is perfect. Also, it comes with straps, which I didn't know when I ordered it. So if you wanna wear straps with this, you totally can. So you have the option, but by far, this is the best strapless bra that I found. All right, so here's the bra. And now I'm going to switch to the push-up. Okay, right. I have the bra on right now, the push-up. Here's what it looks like. I feel like it gives me a little bit more shape up top. Like it looks bigger when I was holding it. It looked huge compared to my other bra. Um, it is a little more shapely, I think. Let's do a side profile. It is a pretty good shape, I think. I do like this. I don't feel like it's being obnoxious with the push up itself, uh, but I feel completely supported. It's weird because I'm trying to look into the camera while I'm also looking into the mirror. And now I feel like I can't even remember the difference because they kind of look the same to me. I might have to like step off away from the camera and see because this is really throwing me off. So I will be right back. One important thing to note with the new push-up bra is that the band is only adjustable from here out. You can't adjust anything from the beginning, which, you know, I feel like can help make it a little more comfortable. Um, but just so you know, it's different from the other bras that you can actually pull the adjustment all the way here. So you only get a slight adjustment option. I've pulled mine all the way down and I felt like it worked. It was pretty comfortable for me. So I finished looking at pictures of myself. I had to take some photos on my phone of me sitting exactly the same. One thing I hate, one thing I hate the most is when you see before and after pictures but you can tell the after picture has been heavily edited. Maybe not even heavily, but just lightened up a bit, like teeth whitening photos. If the skin tone is not the same as the original picture, then you can tell. It's not real, it's not legit. So I wanted to make sure that I was posing exactly the same way, sitting up straight, nice and tall, my hands like, it's just, that's what I was trying to make sure of. So I will put them up right here on the screen because it was hard for me to see on video. I had to look at them like, I've had to be able to switch back and forth and I don't think this push-up is for me. So I'm going to return it, but I am definitely keeping the shirt. I want to buy this shirt in other colors, actually. I just feel like I have bowling balls on my chest. Like I'm already bigger chested and I just don't need this push-up. Um, I do agree it does give you great shape. So if this is, if this is a look that you're wanting, then for sure, go ahead and get it. But for me personally, I am so petite. I just don't feel like I need that extra oomph here on my chest. Um, but I did want the extra oomph on my lashes today. I'm wearing Flutter Habit lashes. I feel like what suits me more is no push-up bra. I don't need the extra help. I'm not going for that extra shape. I'm not going for anything like that. So I'm going to stick with my normal bras my normal strapless bra like i don't need anything else it's just crazy the difference that this can make i do agree though that this push-up which i was going to grab but i'm actually wearing it still um it is one of the better push-up bras that i've seen i like that it doesn't feel like your boobs are just kind of sitting on something to push them up it's just an overall cushion 
all over the bra and it's just very comforting i feel like it's com <laughs> not comforting it's comfortable and i like the full coverage that you get from it so if that's something you're looking for go ahead i do have this feeling that this bra would look better on smaller chested people because it is a push-up bra but i do like that skims shared videos of women of all different sizes to put on the bra um, because it does it's true what it shows is true and i agree with it it does give you great shape but um, I just think it's a little too much for me. Otherwise, if you are interested in this tea, this is the Skims, I don't know if it's the Fit Everybody tea. Actually, I have their seat right here. Yes, Fits Everybody t-shirt. I got this in the Onyx color, it's size small. So absolutely recommend, it is so comfortable and it just looks great on you. So I will link everything that I mentioned down below along with my size so that way you have a reference. But if you have any questions, leave them down in the comments and I will get back to you. Otherwise, I will see you in the next video. Bye.